Hi, my name's Justin with Aqua Illumination based out of Ames, Iowa. Today we're here in sunny San Diego at Macna 2016. And with this, we have the uh, AI Prime HD. So with the AI Prime HD, you get seven different color channels. You get cool white, you get royal blue, deep blue, green, UV, violet, and red. Within those seven color channels, those LEDs are seven of the best LEDs you can get on the market with the tightest binning possible. So with the Prime HD, the HD actually stands for hyperdrive. Now the reason for the hyperdrive is because so many different LED lights out there, you can only have a maximum output of 100% intensity. Well, there's so many LEDs that you're not using. A lot of people use their cool whites, for instance, at 25%, 30%. You might have reds and greens that you're only running at 10%. You have all of this unused and wanted intensity that you want to increase other channels. Many people want to increase their blues, you know, to 120, 150%, but it's not possible because you're only able to go to 100%. Where does HD fit into there? So with the HD, it allows you to bring, it allows you to bridge that gap from all these unused LED space. So you have, again, some of these LEDs you're only running at 10, 15, 20%. The HD allows you to steal those, uh, that unwanted or unused energy and allows you to bring it and, and move it to other LEDs. So for instance, at one time you can only use blue at 100%, well now with the HD, you can drive that up to 150, 180%. So you can really dial in a whole completely different spectrum, even tighter blue spectrum than ever before with our product. Now, a question might be, does the, when you, when you borrow the energy from somewhere else, is it overdriving the LEDs? And the answer to that question is no. It is not overdriving the LEDs. It will not cause any harm to the LEDs. It's not going to take away from any of the lifespan of the LED. So coverage-wise with the AI Prime, it's rated for up to 24 by 24 inches. Many of your best applications will probably run 18 to 24 inches uh, from front to back, you know, width and length of the tank. Um, top depth of maybe around 20 inches. It has very high PAR ratings for such a small, compact LED. So for the AI Prime, we've got three different mounting options. The one shown here is our latest. It's the Prime Gooseneck, and it's a very flexible piece. You're allowed to go north, south, you can move it east, west, and bring it all back in. You can move the down, you can move it level. It's a really very functional product for AI. Um, the AI Gooseneck actually comes in two different sizes. We've got the 12 inch and an 18 inch. So it allows you to uh, you know, have more area to cover. Um, some tanks that many people are using these on are up to like we said 24 inch tanks. Um, so you've got again the two different mountings between the 12 and the 18 inch. Now we also offer two other mounting structures for the Prime. We've got a hanging kit that threads into the back plate of here and it's a pulley system that goes north and south. It's a very nice system for people that want to spend their lights. We also offer a, another mounting option which would be our standard prime tank mount. Well, that's offered in two different colors. We've got black or silver and it allows you to move it both vertical and horizontal. So it's another great mounting solution for another for, for customers. So the Prime HD has the HD features available in the Hydra 52 HD and the Hydra 26 HD. This, the exact same uh, LED features. And what the HD features allow you to do it allows you to customize the LED spectrum while still using the full 48 watts available in the Prime. So for instance, if I wanted to bring down the white here, I'm not using that full 48 watts. As you can see, I'm only using 41 watts. So I can bring, instead, I can bring up, the, say, the blue so that I can get customize that spectrum and still use the 48 watts here. And as the Prime has available onboard Wi-Fi, it's easy to control. I just connect to the Prime HD's Wi-Fi access point, and I'm controlling the fixture. Creating a schedule with the new Prime HD is incredibly simple. Uh, on this schedule page, you just go to Easy Setup here, and you're gonna choose your sunrise and your sunset time. We'll go ahead and set that to, say, four o'clock. And then you're gonna set the Sun, the, uh, the daytime and the nighttime intensity for each LED color. So we'll go ahead and change that. And the, the LED or the color for the LEDs is dynamically displayed on the light so you can see what it's going to look like during the day. 
when you're done, hit done at the top, and the schedule is propagated to the lights. So once again, we want to thank you for coming out and tuning in and checking out our HD AI Prime today. All of us at uh, 2016 Magna San Diego want to say farewell and thank you for your time.